from my fifth to eighth grade diaries from when I was growing up in San Rafael. Uh, when I was 12 years old, I was a tomboy who really wanted to be a girl, but didn't know how. I was also convinced that I was born to party. <laughs> To, oh yeah. <laughs> Naturally, I was conflicted with my 11-year-old feminist leanings <laughs> and my desire to kiss boys. Ultimately, I just wanted someone to love and to build my reputation as a girl that knows how to party. <laughs> Let me just unlock. <laughs> November 30th. I hate boys. I hate them so much. They say all sports are for men. They get on my nerves because they think girls can't do anything, but I'll show them one day. Yes, I really will show them. I'll show them what boys can't do. Like sewing. <laughs> singing. Dancing. Cooking. And all that stuff that boys can't do. So we can show them what girls really can do. <laughs> April 15th. I want to write a story on the Great Depression. But I don't know how. <laughs> Constantly planning expeditions. 
expeditions to Mars, <laughs> which he will pilot as soon as his antibody has been perfected. And now this is mine. <laughs> Mary Van Note can be found in an office that reads, Mary Van Note, <laughs> optometrist. She suffered a great loss recently. <laughs> the death of her loving husband. <laughs> she has recovered from this loss and is enjoying life with her super children, Jacob and Lisa. She's living in her grandparents' house, which has a lot of wonderful childhood memories. So, pretty much, in my future fantasy, I killed off my loving husband.